B team, Gracie Bajas, Pedro Mourinho in the black. Mourinho, ADCC vet. All right, we are underway. Round of 16 for these 88 kilogram competitors. J-Rod might have had the most impressive ADCC trials performance ever with going 7-0 and and seven subs in the West Coast Trials. Level changes here. J-Rod, two-time oh, region champion wrestler, only two years out of high school. Nice little drag there for Mourinho. Mourinho will, too, look for the guillotines. Mourinho has a very strong guillotine from both sides, too, left and right. Trying to two-on-one buy here is J-Rod. And J-Rod has rush. also stayed busy and very successful since his uh, West Coast Trials run. That'll ch level changes here. It's nice one there by Mourinho. He was able to keep a connection with that. Yeah. And you see how, too, how J-Rod moves side to side, right? He'll pull down and you'll see him move out of way so he's not standing directly in front of Mourinho. Two on one here for Mourinho. Trying to clear off the head and square up. Keeping that tool on. There it is. He tries to dip down to that front head, BMAC. Hands are connected. Oh, he jumps he's to the guard here. Made that call. Nice, hey, nice job of stripping that off from Rodriguez. J Rod's very good at guillotine defense, too. So even though it's a big strength for Mourinho, J Rod actually is a very good, does a very good job of defending guillotines. You saw that in the West Coast trials where he was able to escape Sun using gravity. He immediately almost quad pods up to make you have to hang. We've got a story developing in the wrestling here with Mourinho and that two-on-one over here on J-Rod's right arm. He's been able to find that position about three times so far, and the snap down into the guillotine came off of that two-on-one. He snapped him down, jumped on his head, arm drag. Now he gets the leg up. It's, it's in the center, though, so let's see what J-Rod tries to do with it. Now he's pinching it between the legs as he's controlling J-Rod's hand. He's trying to snap down. J-Rod bottom position, he'll frame. He'll stay on the knee. They're going to move him back to center. Rodriguez is a bundle of energy. Isn't yes, he? he is. And listen, you know, J-Rod started right out of high school. Uh, started right out of high school, just got right into jiu-jitsu, saw his brother's path and realized that, you know, if he worked just as hard, he could be on that path. And look at him now, you know, less than two years in jiu-jitsu. And here he is. Now he scoops up that single. And again, Mourinho almost wants you to take that so that he can snatch your neck. There's that two on one again you were talking about, BMAC. He's got a great connection. Look at the way he sticks his chest on the back of the tricep there. Deep into the armpit there with his left arm. Oh, Jay Jay the the body body the back. Now listen, if there is some dangerous positions. And they are gonna keep fighting all the all way right, through Let's see the where end. they're gonna reset. Now here's the deal, when you're going out of bounds, where the ref there. says stop is where he is going to call it from. So if you keep going, he'll just restart your neutral. Now J-Rod's ability to finish from the back for a guy with less than two years of jiu-jitsu is uncanny. His ability, he, he has a great knowledge of hand fighting. There you see that snap down to front head again. And listen, now, man, J-Rod's got a tendency to reach those arms around yes. the body, and that's gonna feed that arm and guillotine of Mourinho. Snatches that single again, Mourinho. There it is again, Armin. this one's deep. Chin to chin, Ooh, this to one's chest deep. compression. Oh, J-Rod pushes out, he's gonna stay around. Look at body lock. J-Rod gets over, so single butterfly, all right, so. This is where J-Rod wanted to be. Now this you can see good for framing from bottom from Mourinho, move, trying to move the head out of position. Now look at J-Rod's head. Look how he's trying to put it back to center. That's discipline. That's discipline from a kid understanding that for this to work, he needs his head in a specific position. Now Mourinho doing a good job of pushing his head out of position to get that leg free. Very nice work from good both these guys. Framing. Good and Mourinho framing. right back to the feet. I can't see either of these guys accepting bottom. Now, I will say this. J-Rod, because of how he's had to learn jiu-jitsu, right? He doesn't have a traditional guard. But something that he's, that's a niche thing that he's very good at is buggy chokes. And the thing is, is when somebody, you know, shoots in or comes in, you're not really ready for the first person's reaction to be a buggy choke. Dude, definitely right? not. Like, but, definitely but you not. better be in 2022, Jay. Yes, sir. We've seen that happen at the 
very high levels. Yeah. Very high levels. They actually had, you know, before or after East Coast Trials, they actually had to change the buggy choke. You weren't allowed to slam because it wasn't felt like it was a submission. That changed. Now it's considered a submission. You are able to slam in a buggy choke. It's buggy definitely choke, as long a as submission. it's locked up. It's definitely a submission. So that's saw. one thing to an ADCC. The only thing you can slam, other than mat returns, mat returns are fine, but the only re way you're allowed to slam is if you are in, tr in danger of a submission. So yeah. not even a trap triangle. Like, it's got to be locked on and you're in danger of being finished. Yeah, I think about one of the great slams in ADCC history, Gio Martinez and Jeff Oh, Lover. wow. Back in the and day, well that timed. one was wild. Well timed. And All we're right. about to hit the points period here. This match, this match has been action packed. Three seconds to points. Yo, and both these guys got gas tanks. All right, now J Rod pushing forward with the inside tie here. Mourinho seems fine on the outside. Let's see if he's still. Let's see if Mourinho baits that lead leg still because there's a lot more to lose here now, right? Yeah, absolutely. That head pops out and J Rod holds him down. Now that's two. Now he's in on the single. Quickly in on the single. Tries and a nice work. J-Rod's going to fight back to his feet. Accepts the guard a little bit. There was no control Ooh, there. I can't man. see him getting the two. Uh, yeah. Nice attempt. No and again, that's a huge, great initiation by Mourinho. But I don't believe he'll get to score the two on that. Just not enough control. And here's the thing. It doesn't have to be fl flat on his back. He just has to be seated on his butter hips. That's, that's right. it. But it has to be seated butter hips and, and you're facing chest to chest. Can't be off on the side. Has to be chest to chest control. Mourinho, oh, heavy touch time. immediately. And I don't think either of these yeah. two could care less about heavy snaps. <laughs> yeah, I think that's why they came. <laughs> They're just nice dudes. That's why I apologize. Now he's in on oh. the single. Here's J Rod. Nice job of Mourinho. Answers right back with trying to pick that leg up. Mourinho looks very comfortable, doesn't he? Yeah, and, and like I said, both these guys got gas tanks. Here's that this two could on be a one. 30 minute match. Oh, into this Zanjeev grip. Yep. Now, Good job of J-Rod of being able to split it off, like push it, you know, extend it so it wasn't in that figure four type grip. Again, winner of this will take on Wagner Rocha. J. Regalbuto here with BMAC ADCC 2022 here at the Thomas and Mack Center. There it is Here's again. Grip. But again, J-Rod does a good job of immediately lengthening his arm. Tried to get that underhook there. J-Rod continuously. Again. Oh, oh wow. there it is. There's his Back exposure. This is Big move by J-Rod. All right, so you see him trying to work up the body. Oh, Mourinho great. trying to move to top. Oh, wow, and he's able to move up. Now, here's the thing. Because of the position they were in, and they were back to chest for a specific amount of time, I don't believe that they're going to give Mourinho any kind I of points so. for this. Because he went back to, he was back to chest and turned facing. Trying to cut that knee through here. Like I said, J-Rod, look for him to either wrestle up or look for opportunities for buggy. Mourinho, well aware. You know and, what I mean? Well he aware. He sets that buggy up right here from this knee shield. He'll, he'll set it up from half guard. He's finished close guard buggy chokes in matches. So he's, you know, they're trying to, you know, let that buggy game evolve. Where's the pass? Almost passed here. There it is. There's the. You made the call there's on the it. There's the buggy. Oh my. All right. So this is a position where J Rod has been. He'll use it to sweep too. But him keeping that knee inside. Him keeping that knee inside. All right, Abe Marine, you're able to split and get some room. Two minutes to go here. Bottom position. Good. Good reset by the referee. B teams. Jacob Rodriguez, Gracie Bajas, Pedro Mourinho. Top position, nothing, nothing here. <laughs> Believe it or not, no calls for action or warnings in this <laughs> yeah. match. Oh, I didn't think we were going to see <laughs> see that at all. Trying to knee cut through here and address that. Oh, he cuts through. He's going to score on this one. He's going to be able to get the three. That's a big play. Well, now, hold on. Now he released. Okay, he he did he get waited, it. Yeah, he, he waited he, until he, waited he got the signal from the table. And then completely released. Now he wants J-Rod to have to play to win that three points back. Yeah, and I, I and but, I think he didn't want to deal with that buggy choke if he stayed in side control either. Yeah. I, right? I mean, listen, it's such a... It's a real move, It man. really is. People and, can sleep on it or they can think... Uh, and if you get caught in, it, work, in a nuanced <laughs> way that you haven't seen yet... Oh, what a great penetration in. there. Snatches that head and arm as Mourinho. So now it's been long enough, too, where J-Rod could pull guard if he wanted to. 
stays with that turtle, though. I feel like Mourinho is working a grip under there, BMAC. Like, I feel like he's trying to gain position to scoop his hips under. Less than a minute to go. J if J-Rod wants this thing, he's going to have to make a play right here. Back up to the feet. They'll move back to center. Just under a minute remains. Again, we are going to take on Wagner Hocha in a round of eight. And Rodriguez pressing forward now. Oh, in on the hips. Up. up on the double. He's going to drive. Oh, oh man. man. Great the save by Mourinho. Geez. And look to Rodriguez's credit. He continued to play through. So, yeah, he's calling. He's saying, do I get the body lock? And the judges say, give him the body lock. Yeah, judges are calling. Give yeah, him the I body lock. Yeah, I think that's the right call. Yeah, for sure. I think that's the right call. Yeah, they're going to have to. He's going to. Mourinho's keep trying to stop that grip from happening. So here's the thing. If Mourinho doesn't accept that position, the judges will come he out has, and force him to he accept, has to accept it. accept it. This Body is a big here moment here for Rodriguez. Especially, oh, man, and he's going to get it. He's going to score two with that. He's going to get the he's two down feet back. With less than a minute to go, 30, 30 seconds, seconds to play. And he's in his position to body lock pass here. He's Rodriguez. got good head position. He's got good control, 25 seconds. Oh my gosh. J-Rod has brought this to within one point. He's going to have to flatten him out a bit more. He's on short time here, 15 seconds. He's got the, he's Mourinho's, getting the play to the head. He is. Oh, now he's got it. He's got that foot in. I, he's just not going to have enough time to control. What a match here. His foot's going to be stuck, and Pedro Mourinho is going to take it by a 3-2 point cow. win over Jacob Rodriguez. Gracie Bajas, Pedro Mourinho in a barn burner. Going right to take it over Jacob wire. Rodriguez. Yo, yo, here's the deal. J-Rod started under me. I got to show the kid a ton of love. He started jiu-jitsu less than two years ago. Won the West Coast Trials in the most impressive fashion ever and just put on an amazing match with somebody like Pedro.